is an honor to be approached by the school's most senior student. My mother had high hopes for the school when she sent me here from the capital. Oh. Sometimes I wonder if I'm ready to train with others of such skill. Even in the robes of a junior student, I feel a long way from my home in the Imperial City. If you are here, you belong here. You're right. Master Lee would not have accepted me if he did not see potential. He measures all people carefully. Agreed. I just have to work twice as hard to catch up to your level of skill. Even then, it will take a long time to be your match. How long have you studied with Master Lee? Well, that's a good question. I've studied with him as long as I can remember. You and Dawnstar both had a lifetime of training under Master Lee. He is stern with you, but you sure can see that he's proud as well. I'm sorry. I shouldn't pester you with my questions. Is there something you need? Hey, I'm a man of the people, man. I'll talk to you. How well do you know the others at this school? I don't know anyone else who displays the skill you do. Perhaps Gao, but he lacks discipline. That is why he still wears the robes of a junior student, despite his abilities. Dawnstar would be next, with few able to match her delicate moves. Beyond that, the only other person I know well is Smiling Mountain, the sparring master. Okay. What do you think of Dawnstar? I know she is sensitive to things the rest of us can't see. Sometimes I feel sorry for her. It obviously makes her feel different. And that's not right. Hmm. Why do you say that? I think she was given a gift. Unlike responsibility, it may not always be pleasant, but it's something she should be proud of. It shouldn't isolate her. Do you have any impressions of Gao? Sounds like a freaking prick. I have seen his kind in the city. He thinks his family's wealth is a substitute for nobility and is angered when others still see him for what he is. Crass and spoiled bully. So he's kind of a prick. All right. Um, have you, how has Smiling Mountain helped you train? Well, he doesn't come close to Master Lee's skill, but Smiling Mountain is good for the younger students. He pairs novices with more advanced students, so we can learn. Okay. Let's not talk about anything special. I'll answer what I can. Um. What do people from the capital think of the Empire? It's funny, but I still want to look over my shoulder. I have to remember that we are a long way from the ears of the Lotus Assassins. Ah. Uh, yeah, why would you be worried about the Lotus Assassins? They're the Emperor's personal guardians. In the Imperial City, they watch everyone and everything, looking for those who would question the course of the Empire. Yeah, they're not good. Let's get back to my other questions. I just want to, uh, fairly new here. Can you tell me something more about yourself? Or that you should ask. What do you want to know? Um, let's see. What, what are you, what are you doing when you're done training here? Well, that won't be for a long time, but I'll probably return to the Imperial City. Perhaps I'll join the Imperial Guard. It's hard to think that far ahead. Okay, fair enough. What brought you to this school? The school I attended in the Imperial City was becoming mired in politics, so my mother sent me out to the country instead. Politics is dangerous, she always said. Yeah, that is kind of true. Um, I'll talk to you later, though. Goodbye. Take care of yourself. I will. You take care of yourself, buddy. I even did a flip just for you. Alright, this looks like another scroll stand. The Old Tongue, Volume 1. Thofan, or the Old Tongue, was the native language of one of many kingdoms struggling for supremacy before the Empire was unified by Sejasus Tien, our first Empire. As the wars raged, constant shifts in territorial leadership spread the use of the Old Tongue. By the time Sejasus Tien formed the Empire, the Old Tongue was so widely spread that it became a second official language of the Jade Empire. Nice. Roadhouse. Uh, I don't want to go there yet. Yeah, Roadhouse. I want to get in there. Let's let, let's fight. Lynn. Our most senior student has a spare moment to spend with me. An honor. I would love to. No, wait. I shouldn't be like that. Master Lee always reminds me that jealousy is a low path and not worthy of one of his students. I understand your training is almost complete. I wonder who will replace you as our example. That's pretty good voice Certainly acting. It won't be me. I can't even imagine Master Lee saying, 
You must strive to be like Lynn in all things to the others. Just the opposite, more likely. You know, Bioware does such a good job with the voice actors because right there you could sense that she's just a little bit jealous. Um, if you want Master Lee to say it, don't give him a choice. Be the best that you can be. That makes sense. Is that how you live your life? If so, it certainly seems to be an effective philosophy. You could just be pouring honey in my ears, but that's not half as fun as other places it could go. What? Oh my, you've gone kind of red. Hell yeah. I shouldn't tease you like that. What Maybe just I happened spend there? More time training and less time worrying about where I stand in the school. How else will I be good enough to take you down one of these days? Besides, there might be bigger things to worry about. I find myself intrigued by the ghost tales that everyone's mentioning. Did she just mention her honey pot? I do not remember that the first time I played. And I played this, man, I was probably like 15 or 16, but I just, I, that did not connect to me. That's pretty crazy. Um, would you be interested in sparring? Of course. I have to keep practicing if I'm going to be able to best you one day, aren't I? Let's begin. Excellent. Let's see if we can use Smiling Mountain Sparring Ground. Once we're done, I'll wander back here if you need me again. Okay. I'd like to do this just one time, and then I'll probably take a break. Oh, jeez, jeez. Okay, the, the, the tough thing with, with her is that... With her is that she's quick. 40 experience points. Hills the year. Hills to the year. Sensei. Experience 40. Sha Ching. Uh, that was fairly easy, and that was pretty good in terms of uh, experience points. Okay, we can't go out of the school yet. I know that for sure. Let's see what happens if we try and do it again. Let's begin. Excellent. I wonder if I get even if, if I get even more stuff. Okay, I gotta double back on her. Oh snap! Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Chick. Oh, jeez, she's got some got some nasty moves there. I love how you can jump over at her. That was something new, I believe, that they introduced in this game was the ability to really like jump over your opponent. Tough chick. Oh, she's gonna beat me. This isn't. Oh, good. I got it. Oh, snap. I'm dude. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Get up. I'll help you up. Okay. Cool. So that's that's about it. Got, oh, nice. Doing a little doing a little dip dip dive dodge duck dodge. Um. Ah, I'm healed. Okay, I, f I forgot about that. So, you've entered focus mode, slows down time. Okay. Wait, what's, what's button ah, for to exit? Okay. Okay. So, let's, let's get out of, let's get out of this. There we go. Let's go to uh Okay, this screen allows you to spend style points. Oh yeah, to learn new techniques. Okay. So you can master them. So you get keep getting points to spend in there. Followers, we're going to be getting lots of followers here, which is going to be pretty sweet. Amulets, this is where you equip um, and you get different slots depending on stuff. This is a journal screen. Click on the quest in the window on the left or individual tasks in the window on the right to be more details. So speak to Master Lee, but there's no rush, so we're pretty good with that. This is a map of your local area. It's going to have the same basic outlay that uh, Knights of the Republic had. No saved games. Empty slot. Uh, we are going to save a game. 
And I'm going to leave you guys. Uh, and then when we come back, we're going to go talk to Master Lee. who has been pitching Ace 88. Hope you guys are going to are starting to enjoy this game, getting wrapped up in it, because I'm going to get really wrapped up in this game. This is one of my favorite Bioware games that was created. This has been Pitching Ace 88. See y'all next time. Over and out.